Hi, my name is Artem and if you're new to the channel, I'm a digital marketer, growth hacker and a serial entrepreneur from Finland. So you've seen the title, right? Sweet tips and win-win people capital. That's what I want to talk about today. I have a friend who messaged me just a while ago telling me about this amazing opportunity. Right? Right? You, you have friends like that as well. I hope not, but maybe you do. So obviously I thought, okay, I'm a bit skeptic. Let's check it out. I saw the company that he was promoting and I was like, I heard about this company before. And if you didn't know, I have a weird hobby. I love to follow MLM companies. I love to attend online events of so-called gurus that promise me the good life. I don't know why. It's just like a reality TV show, right? I know the characters, I know their shticks, I know what they're going to say, I know how they sell it. It's just really, I don't know, I find it fascinating. Obviously, I don't buy in into any of their schemes, but I still enjoy the show for whatever reason. So I heard about this company, Win Win People Capital, and if you check out here, you will see that there are a lot of Russian videos about Win Win People Capital. So it's a company that, you know, originated in Russia and became very popular in Russia. But before we dive in a little bit about my friend. So my friend sent me the link and told me that this is amazing opportunity for me and I could be my own boss. I could get passive income and I could definitely achieve all of my dreams. And I'm like, well, sounds interesting. Tell me more. So he told me about this amazing company where it's kind of like free cash for everybody. You just pay a little bit and then boom, things start happening. Of course, you have to put in the work. You have to recruit the team. You have to, you know, you have to sweat to get results. But, but at some point you will be as successful as this guy, this guy right here. You see, you will be driving Lamborghinis, you will be traveling around the world, you will have so much money that you will not know what to do with. And I was like, hmm, okay, interesting. So anyway, I forgot about it. I kind of thought, well, that's not worth, that's not worth my time. But at some point, a little while ago, he sent me another message saying that uh, Win Win People Capital <clears throat> and Sweet Tips platform are going to be officially opening their operations in USA. And I thought like, whoa, okay, I have an opportunity to make a difference. So Sweet Tips and Win Win People Capital, those platforms have a lot of information about their shady practices and so forth. Well, a little disclaimer. Everything that I say is my own opinion based on information I found just searching on the internet. Basically public source, sources, Instagram, YouTube, Google searches, right? It's my own opinion. I want you to look at the video and make your own decision, right? Okay, now that the boring part is over, let's continue. So a lot of people in USA will be exposed now to Vinven People Capital, to Sweet Tips platform, their amazing cashback service and so on. So I wanted to make sure that there is something in English on YouTube about the platform. An honest opinion, if nothing else, right? And again, if you decide to join, it's your choice. But please watch video till the end. And if you find it useful, spread the word. So. Basically, <clears throat> they're opening their operations in USA and they have this huge launch event. I cannot show you the launch event, even though I would love to do that because obviously they will copyright strike me. But here you can see a little bit about it. You know, you can see how it looks and what kind of, you know, set did they have. It's pretty interesting. So the whole event, two and a half hours was just... Well, if you ever seen MLM events, whoa, those events are pretty high energy. I mean, people are jumping, they're screaming, there is music, 
fireworks and so on you know because that's that's their shtick you know they want to kind of show people that this is something really special and you know win win people capital sweet tips did it on a much smaller scale i think they called the event uh, official opening of sweet platform usa or something i don't know anyway the owner of the company or the founder philip uh, he came on stage and he said that he doesn't speak english well enough so there'll be a translation i was like well okay yeah it's this handsome guy right here yeah look at him looking at you don't you want to be part of a company with a handsome guy like that i'm sure you do anyway he came and he was just talking nonsense i mean for like one and a half hour they talk about wanting to improve the world and uh, conscious consumerism and spreading the joy and all that if you see their promotional video on youtube here is how it looks like we are the new generation we are yeah. achieving we are reaching we are do you know what they're selling creating is it clear we to you? are discovering we are moving running forward mm -hmm. oh, yeah. mm -hmm. still you probably don't know we what they're the doing generation. and what they're selling right we feel okay enough of that so basically it was just nonsense and i enjoy just joining events like this and just trolling a bit you know because i thought that it's my responsibility to join these kind of events and you know troll them a bit obviously i don't want to you know i don't want to insult anybody i don't want to disrupt the event because according to their lawyer this handsome guy everything is legit <clears throat> but i try to uh, ask difficult questions during the event so others who are joining the event and consider joining the program the company so that would actually start critically thinking about what they're watching and this is my kind of way of you know a little bit of sabotage during the live event so anyway i was trolling i was asking questions got banned uh, one time somebody some lady from moscow actually tried to hit on me <clears throat> which didn't make my wife very happy and she was like why are you doing this this is not work you have enough work already and i'm like this is very important stuff come on baby this is very important and she came in and she's like what is that private chat tab i'm like ah some moscow lady telling me what she's wearing and i'm and she was like what so anyway uh, I had fun during the event, right? And uh, all of a sudden, after the two hours, they started talking about what they do. And let me tell you, they have a cashback platform, right? Where they pay really good cashback for, you know, purchases you do online, basically. And this is the, their primary business. So you cannot call it a pyramid scheme when there is actual product that is being sold. Okay, okay, okay. So their product is a cashback platform called Sweet Tips. You can see it here. Basically, you join, and when you join, you have to actually provide a ref uh, like name of the person who referred you, right? Because he will be getting bonuses from you. But if you just type John or Mark or, I don't know, Ivan or, I don't know, what, what other, well, John is not Russian name, but Ivan is o Oleg or Igor, right? Put Igor there. It will work for sure. So basically, you can register and you can use... Uh, temp uh, disposable email addresses and just join and see what's up anyway uh, the cashback platform they offer pretty good you know cashback uh, for purchases in well-established shops and i thought like hmm and then during the presentation and when i was trolling everybody was, was telling me that hey this is a legit business because we have partnerships with this huge amount of big brands gap Old Navy, uh, Xiaomi, uh, I think uh, there are some other big ones. Well, yeah, huge companies, right? 
And I thought like, well, that's interesting. That could be true. If they did make agreements with all of those companies, I'm sure those companies did some due diligence, right? I mean, they don't just sign contract with everybody. Then I registered on the platform. And what do you know? I found out how it works. And there is no real cashback. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's start from the beginning. I registered on a platform. It asks for referral username. I just put Igor there. Let Igor have all the fun. And then I registered and was just browsing the deals. So an interesting deal. Just, you know, a very nice shoes. This, this pair of shoes. And I clicked on the link to go and purchase the product. And then my ad blocker noticed something and then all of a sudden I saw this notification. I thought, huh, that's interesting. I know this platform. This is, is a huge affiliate platform, you know, internationally well-known platform for affiliate marketing. Ah, before we dive deeper into this whole scheme, let's have a quick primer on what is affiliate marketing. So affiliate marketing is when business wants to promote their services or products and they partner up with a publisher, basically somebody ha who has large audience, uh, good quality audience that would suit this particular business. So they make a deal. You bring traffic and if that traffic converts into sales, I will pay you, publisher, as a business, I will pay you a commission on all the sales, all real sales. Okay, that's great. So for example, if I have a blog and I have an audience of people who are interested in fitness, I could partner up with a fitness company and I could promote their products on my blog. And if people end up buying, you know, those products from uh, using my link, my affiliate link, so that businesses can track where the traffic is coming from. If they buy products using my link, I will get commission, 5%, 10%, sometimes even 20%. So that's affiliate marketing. But because this facilitation is really hard, you have to send money, you have to track, you have to prevent fraud and all that. Uh, a lot of affiliate marketing platforms were born in order to facilitate this um, affiliate marketing cooperation between businesses and uh, publishers and one of the biggest is CJ platform cj.com right so when I clicked on the you know go to the store link and saw CJ notice saying that uh, we're collecting data blah 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 do you agree I was like hmm that's interesting so you know what I did I registered on the platform and I went to the advertisers panel and I found this company, Milano, right? I found it right in the platform. And I saw how much they're paying to affiliate marketers and it does make sense then. So their cashback is basically nothing else than registration with biggest affiliate marketing platforms what they do is they pick advertise, uh, they pick, uh, yeah, they pick businesses, advertisers that they like with the biggest um, commission. They place it on their website, and when you click and you buy, right? You click and you buy the product using their affiliate link. They get affiliate commission that they split with you. Obviously, leaving a lot for themselves, right? Cool. So. This is the only innovation that they do. And I guess you and me, we could start something similar. All we need is a website, an agreement with affiliate marketing platform, and then just a small technical integration where we integrate the feeds automatically into our website. So the pricing and pictures and everything gets you know pulled from the affiliate marketing platforms server. And that's it. After that, we can decide how do we split the commission. Do we split it 50-50 with our customers or maybe 70-30 or even 90 and 10. So yeah, 
there is nothing magical about it and they do not have agreements with those big companies and again if you're watching this and you're part of the sweet tips amazing team please tell me show me some agreements with gap with amazon with apple show me agreements between sweet tips and those businesses you will not be able to produce those documents for sure because as you see here it's just affiliate links nothing else and if you check similar webs report on the website you see here that this website doesn't have that much traffic right not a lot of people are using it but let's go back so the cashback platform i told you how it works there is nothing magical about it and yes you can get some money out of it you can get some cash back but again if you register now on sweettips.us and you try to withdraw your money this is what you see nice right very reassuring okay anyway let's go back to actual business so the real money comes in from buying licenses so yeah you can use cashback service you can get some money out of it even though even though according to russian language reviews that i translated here you can see that it, it could be quite hard to get money out of the system according again to information and reviews on the internet so anyway the real business the beef you know is in licenses so the company sells licenses to other wannabe entrepreneurs who can purchase license for like a hundred euro to maybe like 1000 euro right and the the better license you have the more you can earn commission on the cashbacks and on connecting other partners and so forth and so forth but again basically you start to make money once you get the license and once you get the license you will have to start selling you will have to start promoting you will have to promote the service you will have to try to get others to buy licenses from you you will have to tr sell uh, gold partnerships and whatnot again selling 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 right and this is where the money comes in this is the real money and they use predatory sales tactics i guess well i guess predatory in a sense that they try to sell you the dream what is your dream do you want that fast car do you want a beautiful wife or a husband that really loves you do you want to spend time with your kids do you want to get passive income do you want to travel the world do you want to support your loved ones? I have an opportunity for you. Just buy one license, thousand dollars, ruin all of your friendships, spam your Instagram with good living pictures, and that's it. You're on your way to become a billionaire. So, they basically in Russia sell you the lifestyle. This is the MLM's shtick. They sell you the lifestyle. They want to show you how good they have it. And they just show you the money. There is even this stupid thing that Russians do where they just go to the ATM and withdraw like half a million rubles, which in real money is like $2. Just kidding. Russian, you know. Russian currency has been really declining in value. But anyway, they withdraw like half a meal and they're like, check this out. This is real. This is real. To me, that doesn't prove anything else except this is a functioning ATM, right? So they want to sell you the lifestyle. And I don't think it will work in USA. What, what do you think? Will it work? Because I think, uh, you know, very, very admired and respected people like Warren Buffett, Bill Gates, they don't flash their cash, right? And you want to follow their advice because 
at some point, you know, flashing cash and driving fast cars and all that, you know, usually only people who lack critical thinking skills fall for that. Real entrepreneurs, real businessmen, real investors, really wealthy people, they just find it disgusting. Because if you're wealthy, would you be flashing that cash? No, you would be living your life. You'd be enjoying time with your family. You'd be traveling, sharing pictures on Instagram of uh, your travels and just your experiences, right? That's what you would do. You wouldn't go to the, you wouldn't, uh, you wouldn't find Warren Buffett going to the ATM, you know, and withdrawing half a million dollars and being like, check this out, bro. You want some of this? You want some of this action, bro? Yeah, he, no. Bill Gates has this watch. This watch. This is his watch. Do you know how much it costs? You can find it for like 70 bucks on Amazon. They are not flashing their cash because they don't have to. They have nothing to prove to anybody. They already made it. But the way that MLM companies become successful in Russia is that they attack, well, not attack, but they try to sell the dream to people who are very far from the dream. And some of them are even, according to this girl right here on YouTube, according to her, they even use predatory tactics where they tell you to go and get a loan do whatever, sell your car, get a loan, whatever, just buy the license, become an entrepreneur, right? And they talk about doing your own thing, starting your own business, but are you really, are you really starting your own business? You basically bought a license for $1,000 and now you're trying to sell some BS to your friends and family in order to get money from them, in order to get commission on you know, they're spending. And obviously, at the top, this handsome guy right here, you remember him? Yeah, him. So, he enjoys all the benefits of having a large team. Even though it's a huge company, on LinkedIn there are 17 employees. 17. Does it look like a huge company? Well, anyway, let's go back. So, at the top, there is a lot of money but the lower you go, the less money there is, right? And in company like this, you continue making a lot of money as long as you can bring new members. So this is the reason that they started in Russia, but then they moved to Ukraine, then they moved to Kazakhstan, and uh, now USA, cause there is just not enough new customers, there, is, there are not enough suckers to fall for the scheme, so they have to expand, right? And again, I want you to make your own opinion and I want you to make your own decision. But when you register for Sweet Tips and you read the agreement, it's humongous agreement, you see that they're based in Cyprus. That's weird, right? They have an American company as well that I couldn't find any info about. And this is the office of the USA company. Does it look like a prestigious office building, you know, where a multi-billion dollar or whatever uh, company is located? No, it looks like a school or whatever. Just a basic uh, civil building where normal people live. But anyway, so company is registered in Cyprus. And if you decide to take them to arbitration as they want to go to arbitration and at court, you have to do it in Cyprus. Mm, not really good, I think, way to start a relationship with your customer. Another thing is in US, if you are paying, um, if you're paying whatever commission to US citizen, you have to make sure that you don't break any IRS laws. You have to find their SN, SSN, I think, right? Tax uh, identification ID and so forth. And when I registered, nothing was asked of me, nothing. I registered with a fake email address, fake name, fake referral code. It all worked, right?
that doesn't sound like a doesn't sound like a legit legit business so let's go back and summarize it's a weird founder who seems to be very popular in Russia and people just adore him just adore him for whatever reason I mean he's really handsome for a bald guy he's 9 out of 10 for sure for a bald guy so a founder that I couldn't find much information in English about from France okay company that is registered in Cyprus and uh, yeah located near the gas station that seems legit as well right with a US company that is located in a civil building doesn't look like an office at all business where the main product is cashback platform that is not really based on any agreements with big brands that they represent just a simple integration with already existing affiliate platforms nothing unique you could have a similar website done in a few weeks and you can start selling cash back services right a company that resembles every other MLM company out there huge live events a lot of energy the dream and an opportunity to lose all your friends and the real money the real money comes from selling licenses and selling licenses to other people and getting commission on their sales and so forth traditional MLM tactic right and again a company that has a lot of negative feedback reviews already in Russia and most likely will have a lot of negative feedback in USA as well so Hopefully you found this video useful. If you like it, like and subscribe and remember to share it. I want to make sure when people search on YouTube for sweet tips, for win-win people capital, this is the English video that they will find. Thank you very much. Have a lovely day. And if you didn't get it, my honest opinion, stay away from this company. Enjoy it see the dumpster fire burn just consider it another reality tv show that you can watch from afar enjoy and then go back to your real job where you make real money where there is a company that actually pays you salary takes responsibility pays for your sick leave and so forth don't fall for the dream because this ain't no dream all right, Artem out. Take care.